So uh, recently, a, a human head was found. Like there was a person who was walking his dog, and in the process of doing so, he came, his dog started, you know, rustling around where this like bag was, and it turns out there was a human head. And the human head belonged to a male between the ages of 40 to 60. Anyway, um, so, so this is in Los Angeles. This is in Los Angeles, and then they found um, hands. Yes, yeah, uh, Nearby, uh, not in the same area, but nearby. So uh, right now, authorities are investigating the situation. The dog walker who discovered the severed human head um, called the authorities, which is great. But then right afterwards, he took a photo of it and then he tried to sell it. Oh, look at this country, man. Look at this the state we're in. Like. They don't think like, oh my God, I'm aghast and I, I'm going to help try to solve this case or I'm so glad I at least found this poor person and maybe we can put them, you know, it, you know find their family and have a funeral. They think, how am I going to make money? Oh, I got a decapitated head here. Oh, yes. Okay. Time to cash in. Who looks at a decapitated head and thinks, I won the jackpot? A dog walker in L.A. There, look, there's no question about it. People are looking to cash in on everything. They're looking to be famous by doing anything. This guy who found the decapitated head tried to sell it to TMZ. And TMZ said no, which I give them a lot of credit for. When TMZ thinks you're skeevy, you got some issues. Yeah. Let's, let's, let's be honest, dude. Um, TMZ didn't buy because they can't show a decapitated, decapitated head on TV, is my guess. It's not like they're moral and like, oh. They can on their website, rather, though, which not. still makes a lot of money. They, they, they probably wouldn't do it there either just because of the, out, the outcry. The guy's coming up wrong because he thinks that he can get somewhere with selling this, but he can't really show it anywhere. That's where his problem is. I mean, dude, it's, it, it's not, I don't think it's holding up the investigation is, uh, is the only point I'm making. I think he's going to be fine with that and him trying to sell it. If, and if somebody can show it, guess who's going to look at it? Everybody. So, I mean, it's, it's a society factor as far as I'm concerned, not just this one guy who decided to sell this human, the picture of the human head. It's the people who are going to go and look at it and pay money and, and or at least visit a site enough to generate enough attention. Yeah. And that's who we are. I agree with that. It is a societal problem. And the same goes for reality shows, right? Like, we reward people for acting like idiots on reality shows. We watch it because it's entertaining. We want to see the decapitated head because it's not necessarily entertaining, but it's interesting to a lot of people. So yeah. it is a societal issue.